<clears throat> Gosh, can you tell I wasn't ready for that? So I just edited my first vlog in like two years. If you have watched um, the vlog that is going up before this, uh, doesn't really explain much. Um, I found it really hard to come back and I have tried this so, so, so many times, it's unbelievable. And I think I was just finding, like coming back and trying to explain literally the past two years was just, was too much. Um, so I kept putting it off and so the last vlog doesn't explain anything. It's not my finest work either. Um, and really, I guess, was just the, cool, you've done a vlog now, now you can do it again. I mean, I literally filmed all the footage on my phone, um, whereas this is on my camera again. Um, I literally even had to remember how to, like, turn this on, I'm not even joking. But yeah, reteaching myself, editing. Yeah, gosh, this is boring, isn't it? All of that to say, hello. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Short at some point, we'll have a proper catch up about the past two years. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen my life anyway. I didn't really stop there, but um, if you are only a YouTube follower or um, have just found my channel, gosh, there's a big, there's a big jump in between. But um, yeah, please let me know if there's anything you want me to catch you up on. But I have a little boy. Um, I am married to my childhood best friend and we live in the southwest of the UK and that's pretty much it, I'm a stay at home mum um, and I'm just finding my feet with my hobbies again um, so yeah welcome welcome to this ride um, currently this week I am solo parenting um, my husband Noah is off snowboarding in Italy all right for some in it um and it is currently tuesday and he went on saturday um so yeah we're almost halfway through or about roughly ish halfway through and um i just thought it'd be fun to vlog kind of like doing solo mum life I feel very fortunate and privileged that this is not my everyday because it's tough and shout out to all solo parents you're amazing yeah this is not a scratch on that i appreciate um but yeah just kind of how we keep ourselves busy what our routines look like um because it obviously shifts things a little bit without an extra person um and i also thought for me it would be a little bit of company talking to myself on a camera um but yeah i'm hoping that we'll get to film some fun things and you guys can tag along um, it's been quite a productive week so far, really. I've managed to get lots done. Um, I've been with people quite a bit, actually, um, so I haven't felt massively lonely. Uh, and perhaps this latter part of the week will look slightly different. Um, I'm going to go see my parents tomorrow. Um, but other than that, we have no major plans. So I'm interested to see what it's going to look like. Hopefully, yeah, we'll do some fun things and you guys can join. It is, I don't even know what time it is, let me check. It is five past 12. Um, my little boy, little baby, oh, he's not a baby anymore, he's a toddler. Um, he's called Levi, he's having a little snooze, um, which is brilliant actually. He's slept, he's currently um, had I want to say like an hour and hour and fifteen so far, and I managed to transfer him from the car into his cot, so he's sleeping upstairs. Um, I do have the monitor on, so that's okay. Um, oh, why did that fail? Interesting. Right, okay. So this is the part I'm like a bit unsure about. I've edited this vlog, and now it's telling me that the share failed, and I don't know why because it's been a little hot minute. Why is that such a large file? Is that normal? I don't know. Maybe I don't have enough storage. Maybe if that does anything different. Honestly, I'm not a tech quiz. My husband is. And he actually does like video editing as his job, which is ironic. Maybe I should get him to edit my vlogs. Now, if you're watching this, you can edit my vlogs. Anyway, I'm gonna try and see if I can figure this out. And I, I have literally spent his whole nap editing the vlog so I'm gonna just take five I might read a little book for 
for a little bit just before he wakes up and then we'll probably have some lunch i guess find new places to vlog now and also you're gonna close the cupboard on you <laughs> that's not gonna work <laughs> oh cough cough i don't like i can't really see you but i think you can see me you know i'm long working up huh, with my bubba I'm a bit poorly today, so I think we're gonna do some lunch and then maybe because the weather is lovely, maybe we go for a little walk. I realise I'm really terrible at vlogging when you've been out of it for so long. It's really unnatural to go back to picking up a camera. But it's a little bit later now. We were gonna go out for um like a walk, um where my words like slightly further away um but i've decided we'll still go for a walk but we're gonna go around here because i want to do some other stuff as well and i just feel like going further would take up the whole afternoon um and it's already like half two i made some jelly last night um for sensory play levi's not done that yet and i very much meant to buy a tough tray and i forgot <laughs> so i've put him in his high chair I want to make some brownies and I also thought he could like maybe help with some of that too so we're just gonna get a bit messy um then I think we'll go for a walk but I really want to um I've just made like a fun dance playlist and I want to listen to that so I'm gonna like probably not have sound on so yeah baby so I don't get copyright um, yeah we'll see we'll probably get very messy montage oh this is fun right Levi what does it feel like a little cold Well, I think you enjoyed it, didn't you? Who's that? Uh, uh, Who is it? Uh, Levi and Mummy. <laughs> That's your tummy. You just filming your tummy, baby. Nah. Right. Ready? New shoes. I need new jeans. Don't I? Yeah, mummy look awful. Let's take oh, this down. Try and look a bit more presentable, shall we? Shall we go? Ready to go? Okay. You're so cute. You're so cute. Oh gosh, my skin does not look good on this camera, does it? I mean, it doesn't look good in person anyway, but we're seeing it all right now. Um, oh, well, that's real. Um, I'm going to put you in the cupboard now because baby's not here to uh, smack you away. Yes, it is quarter to eight. Um, Levi's in bed. He's got a little bit to go down tonight, actually. Um, normally, it's around like half past six ish um uh but tonight was seven which obviously is still pretty good um but yeah he just was fighting it 
but um but I've come downstairs, I've taken the bins out. Sorry, I'll turn it down. Just a monitor. We have like ocean white noise. Yeah, I've taken the bins out, I've done the washing up, I've done 90% of the tidying, like all his toys are away. The kitchen has had a little bit of a reset. I had washing to take out the washing machine um, and I didn't feel like filming any of that, to be honest. Um, I'm just making myself a cup of tea and I the flowers that we bought earlier. Um, I'm just gonna take the labels off and make sure my mum's Mother's Day present is sorted and like cards written and stuff and everything because I just won't um, have time to do that in the morning um, and then yeah we're going to Cornwall tomorrow um, which isn't a super far drive um, but oh, my dad has to day off work so we're probably going to go down mm, I don't know I'm thinking possibly leaving by like nine because we're awake and ready by then um we'll pop in and see my gran and give her flowers and a card too um and then i think me and my mum are going out for lunch and my dad is gonna have the baby which works out very well for me too so um i don't think he's looked after him yet well i've not left him with him yet he's more than capable three children and two grand and now his third grandchild um that wasn't questioning his ability uh <laughs> um but yeah i'm gonna chill then i think well, i don't really know what i want to do um but yeah i'm gonna try and sort out the flowers oh and then i have brownie i've got a brownie the recipe I used yesterday needed single cream and I didn't need to use all of it so I still got some single cream left so I might put my brownie in the microwave with some single cream perfect I'm a big lover a big 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 lover of like warm and cold combos Ooh. oh gosh I'm really excited about that apparently Cup of tea, flowers, brownie. That was a mission! You're gonna have to excuse the uh, car is trying to warm up. Quarter past nine. You can't hear me, can you? Right, we'll talk, we'll talk later. That's a bit better. I am driving down to my parents uh, but we just popped into home bargains because the closest one to where we live uh, is something, something I always drive past um, normally when he's sleeping so I thought right we'll do it while he's awake um, but, but we it wasn't actually didn't massively have anything that I wanted in there um, but they did have a toothbrush for him which we did need um but yeah we're gonna get on the road now saying it's like an hour and 20. um so that's not too bad good evening um i know i said i filmed today i didn't like not even a little bit um it was yeah just one of those really lovely times when you're just caught up being with family um and don't really want to pick up the camera um but we had a really nice time i was able to see my gran which was lovely and then me and my mum went for lunch um while my dad had levi <laughs> um i mean we probably got on for maybe like just over an hour they survived um but yeah we got home about an hour ago um, Levi slept most of the way in the car. Sorry, it's like 10 to 9, so I got home just before 8. Um, Levi slept for most of the journey and then woke up literally like 10 minutes before we got home. Um, and then he 
it's blessing me doze back off again um like i'm trying to get him out of the car see which obviously then woke him up let me put you down two seconds yeah so i then i had to kind of wake him up again um i fed him and then he did go back down eventually um so i've just come downstairs and a little bit of a tidy um obviously we haven't been here all day but he still makes a mess in the morning and we just didn't tidy it up before left um i've got a little bit of washing up to do in a second but um i'm not entirely sure what our plan looks like tomorrow um so i'm just making our lunch we are gonna go we're going to our church like toddler group play group um in the morning um we'll probably get the bus because it's just it's a good one to get the bus for and it finishes about like half 11 um and then normally we've just got the bus i'll just get the bus home and have lunch here um but i'm potentially seeing a friend um so i just want to keep I want to keep our options open um, and I don't want the fact that like I forgot lunch to be an issue. Um, I know I could buy it out but um, I don't need to so it's like right just put some pasta on and then like even if we don't um, end up meeting got lunch sorted for tomorrow. Win win innit? think Levi's passport arrived while we were out so I'm just gonna check that um but if I'm honest I'm so tired yeah like I said it's five to nine um the drive really wiped me out it's not a hard drive it's just it was like misty and raining and yeah I don't like particularly driving in the dark um, so I feel like I just was concentrating really hard, as you should be when you're driving, but I'm tired. Um, so I'm probably going to have my cup of tea and head to bed in a bit. I had planned to have a shower because I need to wash my hair. Um, well, either dry shampoo that or... Pff, I mean, I'm not going to have a chance in the morning, am I? Um, but yeah, I'm going to say good night and I will see you tomorrow. Good morning! Uh, it probably doesn't look like I even slept, um, but it is now in fact the morning. I've got into a really bad habit of like, some people will probably think this is gross, but if I know the top I like was wearing yesterday needs a wash anyway. It's kind of like falling asleep now. Um, don't know. Um, <gasps> really? What have you got? Have you got a book? But I'm just making us both some breakfast. Um, maybe I literally just always was moving. Taking all the shoes down. So now I need to go tie that up. You fall on your toes. It is five past seven. Um, I think his stirring woke me up, but I actually kind of like properly woke up before him. Um, and. No, I was here. I would have then gone for a shower, but he's not, so I didn't. Um, excuse me. You know you're not allowed up there. Hello. Oh, book. Thank you. What's what sound does this one make? What sound does a cow make? Can you remember? Or what sound does 
this sheep make? Oh. Okay. What sound does a sheep make? What sound does the sheep make? Not playing ball. Right, come here, Squid. Good boy. Being slightly feral. Um, but we're picking our battles this week. And I'm also really learning with a boy, like, like they do just have that little bit of them that, like, needs to be a bit wild. So let your no be no and your yes be yes. Um, and I will choose when my no is no. I'm just putting the last bits together. Um, gosh, this is very flattering as well. Come here. On your bottom. On your bottom. Levi, you can't walk off of there, darling. Oh, honestly. You are just someone else. Um, yeah. The bus. Say bus. Bus. Hmm. Oh, thanks. All right, I need two hands now. What a palaver. The um bus didn't show for like thirty minutes. Um. So I am. Um, now we're walking. We got a different bus, so now we're walking. Um, and I can't push the pram one hand. back home I had to pop in and get some like paperwork bits for something and um, they were in the bottom of the pram and it's so windy today so so windy they flew out from underneath the pram onto like one of the main roads and um, I was like right and I could see it and I was like okay I'll just follow along the road and then like I might be able to like pop the pram to the side um, and this guy and, and like I, I started like walking quite quickly then I like turn into a bit of a jog with the pram. Next thing I know, this guy comes running out of the restaurants that are ne like literally next to it, the road, and um, he like runs, thankfully it was just to the side of the road, runs and grabs my paper and like passes it to me. I was like, oh my goodness, thank you. It got in like a puddle already, but I had like a proper damsel in distress moment. Um, and this guy, I was like, just a bit I was really embarrassed um and then yeah it was so just so lovely like that somebody obviously saw I had a pram he sort of left what he was doing just to come out and get it so it was very kind very very kind um, and after all of that we um yeah went in and did what we needed to do in town um and then I was fully prepared to get on the bus because Levi was still awake and then literally when I got to the bus stop he'd fallen asleep so I checked bus times saw there was one in like half an hour I was like right I'm doing something for me I went and got a drink um I'd packed my book in my bag and I sat and I read for like 20 minutes 15 20 minutes which isn't very long uh, well probably more like 15 I guess by the time I sat down it's just me time it was really nice. Um, then we got the bus home, and now we're back home. Um, we had some lunch on the bus, didn't we? A little bit. Um, but he could probably do with some more. By lunch, he ate like three bits of pasta, a whole pack of animal biscuits and yogurt. So. Um, and I did manage to eat a little bit, but I'm going to carry on now. Um, Emily and her sister are coming around in a bit, which is really nice. Um, and I feel like, I don't know about any other stay-at-home mums, but like, I kind of like getting out at least once a day. And often if I've just done the once, I'm then okay to be in in the afternoon or like whatever. Um, he's played out, we've seen people for him. I did something for me and out back home. They're gonna pop round 
and then it'll be dinner time bedtime so it, like it feels really manageable then um and i can do any jobs this evening that i needed doing today um but actually the house wasn't too messy kind of kept on top of everything so it's not too bad the only thing i did do which to be fair in almost 15 months of his life considering this is the first time it's not that bad I left his water bottle at um play group so we'll get that on sunday it's not a problem but it's a little bit annoying then like for my plans tomorrow i'm like oh i'm gonna have to take out like a cup and a bottle of water for him rather than like as in like um well he could drink out of a normal bowl but it's an elephant what does it do it goes Levi can go Boo! Good boy. Um but yeah. I think that's Emily now. Excellent, yeah, they're on their way. So they'll be here soon. I'm gonna have a cup of tea. Can you show everybody the elephant? Yeah, clever boy. And then what's this one? What's this one do? Oh. Ooh, yeah, clever. It's a monkey. We're getting there with our sounds. Oh, oh. Yeah, you are so smart. Oh. That is an elephant. And it goes with this big old trunk. Oh. Yeah, we're going to have a catch up oh. this afternoon, which would be really nice. Oh. Why are you having fairy girls? Um. I guess I'll catch you maybe dinner. Yeah. What should we do for dinner? Maybe jacket potato. Oh dear. Right. Well, we've made it to 6 pm. And it's bath time in the house. Bath time. Go on in. Ready? If I know I'm not going out again, which is literally 100% of the time, um, I often use like his bath time to take my makeup off and stuff because like I'll get too tired later. Um, and then it's just done. And I take it off properly so I'm not tired. Um, but yeah, this is quite a normal evening for us to be honest. Um, he didn't really like dinner, which is fine. He kept asking for a yogurt. Um, so after I gave him one, he kept asking. And he's already had another one today, so it wasn't going to happen. He only slept for like half an hour. I don't know if we've already said that long. Um, which is quite a short nap for him now. Um, so for his sake and mine too. If he goes to bed soon, that'd be quite good. Um, nice. Bath. 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 Uh, boo. Uh, boo. Uh, boo. <coughs> oh. Oh, should have warmed up my voice first. Um, in case you couldn't tell, I showered. Um, I managed to shower, I've come down, tidied everything, put a wash on, um, did the washing up. I also prepped lunch again because that was really helpful today. Um, I'm not sure quite what tomorrow will look like, um, but like I said, uh, yesterday I did like it doesn't matter. Okay, so I've got lunch prepped so literally just did the same pesto pasta I know it's not brilliant um, but it's what it is um, it's what we had in and I'm trying to be cheap this week um, made a cup of tea just to eat the last of the brownies and it's 5 to 8 and part of me wants to do scroll the other part of me wants to read and the other part of me wants to start putting some of this vlog together 
um because i think as a map it's all about finding those like little 15 minute slots like you don't get two hours where you can sit down and know you won't be uninterrupted so it's all about just going cool what can i do in 10 minutes and doing that um and i know i always feel better for it so i'm kind of like well why don't i just give myself a head start even if it's just getting the footage like started like chopping changing um so i might do that um On a lovely day but i haven't stopped since this morning but I literally have not stopped um and i normally use like leave my nap time just to sit obviously i sat in a coffee shop and that was really lovely um but i still find like i don't switch off obviously because i'm not about um and that was really really lovely and really needed but i just kind of want to switch off my own home and just potato you know, um, sorry about the washing machine, I didn't even think about that bit. Um, but yeah, I might go sit for a little bit. Don't know. Oh, it's a good cup of tea. It's a good cup of tea. Hello, um, it is Friday, um, and it is like literally lunchtime um well not my lunchtime i'm gonna wait for the uh, child to wake up but he's down for a nap um he's probably been sleeping for about half an hour maybe um i've just been reading it's been nice um i'm just importing um some of this vlog from my phone like the little clips i've been getting um just so i can clear up some storage on my phone this camera battery is now flashing so i'll change that but yeah, I'm not really sure what we're going to do for the rest of the day. Uh, we went to the library this morning for rhyme time. And it's so windy and horrible outside. I want to stay in. But I know it'll be better if we go out. But I'll wait for him to wake up and then we'll decide what to do. And guys, I told you when you get off the bandwagon of filming, it is not second nature anymore. nine um the kiddo went to bed really well but he has since woken up twice which is unusual for him at the minute um it used to be standard how am i getting from done anyway i um actually had quite a productive evening oh no that was my mum hot cross bun and i think it Burnt a little bit. Oh, fucking sad. Um, but these are brilliant. What are they? Salt caramel and chocolate hot crust buns from Tesco. So good. I like the Tesco finest ones, but they're always on offer. Just saying. Ow! Hot though. Um. <laughs> Pop that up. Right. Sorry. What did I do? I did all the, all the washing it up. Oh, and then I cleaned out like our water dispenser in the fridge. Cleared our whole fridge, took all the washing down, reorganized the toy box, then started on the shelves in our lounge and then decided I didn't like it. And now I can't undo what I've done. Um, but yeah, past few nights I've been in bed at this time. <laughs> but I'm kind of like, Actually not super tired yet. I'm painting my nails too. Um and I've cut my thumb. Don't know. But it feels like a paper cut. It hurts. Um but yeah, I've got a few little bits that I still wanted to do. And I was watching a Bible study on YouTube. I'm gonna finish watching that. And then like do the little paperworky bits that I was gonna do. Um and then I'll probably, we get up early, like if we have an okay night, we get up early, we might go for a walk in the morning because it's supposed to be raining from like half nine I think. So it would have to be an early walk. And if we don't do that, I'm going to have a cosy morning with, with the boy. 
um but yeah I pro I'll carry the vlog on till tomorrow I think because today has been enough enough day for vlogging I'm really sorry um I'm really aware I touch my face all the time and that's why I have breakouts bad habit well I'd fully anticipated to say good morning to you before we went to the beach but I did not anyway this is a uh, quick hello and I'll see you in a second because he is cold and grumpy which is fair enough it was very cold out there um but it's about quarter past nine we've had a really nice like fresh beach walk this morning um it's pretty empty to be fair we thought we'd get up and out before it rained um and I do I feel it's brewing but it's very cold so I think should we go home and have some hot chucks he's cold um but honestly like this car park is essentially empty there's like a handful of people here and obviously somebody's parked like right next to me like and it's really obvious like that I have a car seat in the car anyway yeah don't know we'll probably head home um unless I totally change my mind <laughs> yeah should we go home okay get milk. Maybe we'll go out for a walk later and get milk. I also need to get fuel. Uh. Right, see you a bit. Hello, we're back home. Um, I can't quite remember what I last said, but we are back home after little man had a short nap in the car. I tried to bring him inside and keep him asleep, but that didn't happen. Um, but that's okay, isn't it, baby? I got myself ready, um, which just feels so nice. And I've put on, it's not eyeliner. I did eyeshadow um, as eyeliner. Um, for the first time in a long time. Um, so I'm like, who is she? Um, you're playing with your nappies. Cling ones, obviously. Um, and yeah, I need to do, there's stuff I need to do um, ideally before we go and get Noah and there's other bits I can do when he's here. Um, I realised that every time we, we've got, sorry, I don't think I've explained this. We're hosting uh, some friends tonight and we're just doing takeaways so like I don't have to cook or anything, which is ideal. But like, <laughs> it dawned on me yesterday, we only own six forks six knives six spoons um and whenever we host we normally do like pizzas or something so it's not really a problem um we're getting takeaway but like don't know what we're doing but there's gonna be more than six of us i'm like right need to go and buy some cutlery that's what we need to do um so i was expecting it to be like raining raining it currently isn't and i think it's possibly just gonna be like spitting misty rain um so i'm gonna go out and brave it anyway my hair's already dropped so it doesn't really matter um and i'm gonna take him to the pram we'll go for a little walk um and pick up some cutlery thank you thankfully we've got um shops that should have that uh that aren't too far from our house so we can go and get that um and you having fun there he could not be sat closer to me if he tried i'm just playing with the nappy pack anyway um yeah really boring we need to go get cutlery we need to go get uh, a friend of flowers so i'll probably do that at the same time i need to do ironing today but that's okay i can do that when noah's here um, and then yeah, I probably need to sort a little man out with some lunch and then we can probably get in the car. I don't know. I've been tracking their flight um, cause we're gonna go pick, I don't even know if I've explained this, gosh, sorry. We're picking Noah up, not from the airport, from like halfway home. Um, just cause like everybody else is going off in a different direction. So it just makes sense. And it's an hour for me to drive there. Um, and it's an hour for them to drive. So hopefully by the time that they're like leaving the airport, if I leave, we'll get there at the same time. Um, but yeah, it's like 
possibly right across lunchtime that we need to be in the car i'm not really sure but i was tracking their flight and they initially were delayed but the flight tracker says that they'll be landing in 45 minutes i don't know if they will or not obviously i have to wait for like their baggage and all of that so i'm like uh allocating maybe an extra 45 to an hour depending on how quick they get through like passport baggage all of that kind of stuff um but yeah the flight tracker seems to be wrong because when i initially went on it it said that they'd like departed 20 minutes ago and no was still texting me like no nah, we're still on the runway runway in italy so um i'm actually not really sure all that to say we should definitely go and do our errands now um because i actually don't know how much time i've got which is not good for somebody like me i don't do well with that should mummy stop talking and we go out <laughs> you don't care do you he's just we've got these like soft play blocks and he's just munching on those is that nice <laughs> lovely oh and now the other one wonderful